Hi, I'm Tracy. I'm one of the dietitians from the Nepean Blue Mountains Local Health District. Like everyone else, I find it really difficult to stay on top of things at home and actually provide healthy meals. But being a dietitian, I know some really good tricks to make that job easier. Just to let you know, I'm definitely not a chef. I'm also not a celebrity. I'm just a regular mum. And the recipe we're doing today is really cheap, healthy, easy, and family friendly. For our recipe today, I've gone to the local supermarket to get all our ingredients. You don't need to go to any specialty stores. All um, supermarkets have a great range of foods to make many healthy recipes. Now the first step today is to grate the veggies. If you grate the veggies, the kids are likely to eat them. Carrots again are a vegetable and the great thing about carrots is they're really rich in vitamin A which is fantastic for your eyesight. You don't need to take the skin off the zucchini. They're actually um, great to leave it on and it adds extra fibre. So a great thing about the onions is that they are a vegetable and they're also a fantastic addition to any meal to add lots of taste and flavour. Okay, so the next ingredient is the rice. So we need half a cup of rice, and rice is a carbohydrate which gives us lots of energy, and it's important to include some type of carbohydrate in every meal that you eat. So we're just using a non-stick fry pan today. The great benefit of that is that you don't need to use any oil. Oil just adds extra calories usually to a meal, and we've got the lean pork that has enough fat in that to um, add the flavor that we need. So first of all, I'm going to brown the onion. Popping the onions in. So the fry pan is now heated up. We're adding two tablespoons of garlic. And garlic adds a lot of, lot of flavor to our meal. So just adjust the heat as you go. So the benefits of the pork are that it's actually leaner in saturated fat than red meat and it also adds a different type of flavour to this type of meal. We just pop the mix in. And then we're just browning the, the, the meat. Okay, so once the meat's browned, just turn, it, turn the heat down a little bit and now we're just going to add the rest of the grated vegetable. And the great thing about using different coloured veggies is it makes the meal look a lot more attractive and also usually makes it taste better. Um, it's actually starting to smell really, really good now. We're going to add the Chow Ming flavor sachet. Doesn't matter which brand that you get, just anyone. It's quite a common um, sachet that you find in any supermarket and it's called Chow Ming Min. So it's just a powder, it's got lots of flavors in it and you just sprinkle that over. And the last ingredient, a uh, half a cup of uncooked rice. So any type of white rice is fine. So the last ingredient, which helps to cook the rice, is one and a half cups of water. So we stir all that through and make sure it's on a medium heat. And then for the rice to cook, we actually let it simmer for about 20 minutes on low heat. And then it's ready to eat. So I'm just going to taste it to make sure the rice is cooked. So just taking a small amount, making sure it's not too hot. Mmm, yum. So meal time is best at a dinner table. It's a great opportunity to have discussions with family and it is really important for children to build healthy eating habits. The best drink at meal times is water. Mm -hmm. Yum! Yeah.